Hey YouTube, welcome back to my channel. Yeah, I'm sorry I didn't get back to y'all yesterday. <laughs> but you know, once you get home, you start doing this, start doing that. Um, yeah, and I kind of totally lost track of time. And so I know I had to do it in the morning, first thing in the morning, I'll get it together. But y'all, welcome, welcome, welcome. Welcome back to my channel. And I'm not gonna keep talking, I'm gonna go ahead and get into this here video. Okay, y'all, this video is about um, when Liv, you know, was in her car and she called Gerard's um, girlfriend the help. Now, that's definitely a classic sign of bitter baby mama. Um, she's bitter, you know, and she's angry because Gerard has moved on. And to call somebody bitter, I mean, to call somebody the help, um, that is a bitter baby mama. Um, Ex-wife, wife, all of that. You know, she's upset that um, old girl came in and did what, we, what she was supposed to do as a woman. Now, how would she feel if, you know, old girl didn't like kids you know even though she don't have any what if she how, how would she have felt that um, old girl faked it you know um, didn't want him to be around his kids because I'm sure she probably pushed him to get his kids like get your kids you know we see this whole train wreck you know going on get your kids she probably she seems to me to be the type of person that motivates him, that gets him where he needs to be. So, Liv is mad about that, you know. Instead of her, you know, uh, being thankful that, you know, her, her baby daddy um, decided to take that step to, to free her up for the summer, y'all. She free for the summer, and he has somebody there that helps him out with his children. You know, for her to say that she's trying to be um, her mother, their mother, that's not what she's trying to be. She's not trying to be that. She's, try she's not trying to be nobody's stepmom. I don't... Um, Stepmom only come into play when somebody gets married, right? Um, they're not married, you know. She's just their friend, you know what I mean? Um, and they respect her. And I think that's what Liv hate the most is that the kids respect her. <coughs> Excuse me, y'all. Me and this call. Mm. I know I need some water. Don't judge me. But anyway, um, <clears throat> she, I see, let me tell y'all something. I don't have no problem with my baby daddy's wife, you know. She, you know, she comes in and she do what, you know, what anybody would do. I'm not um, bitter that he's moved on. Um, <clears throat> Shit, I'm happy. Um, you know, and as long as my kids respect her, hold on. <coughs> <coughs> I'm sorry, y'all. <clears throat> as long as my kids respect her, I'll respect her. You know what I'm saying? So, I don't sit there and be trying to sabotage anything. Um, or anything of that nature because that's not in me. I'm not going to sabotage something that I don't got nothing, you know, to do with or talk about, you know, anybody. Um, hold on, y'all. <clears throat> or talk about anybody um, on how they, they are the help and, um, or any of that, you know. Only when you disrespect me, yeah. But other than that, I don't have anything bad to say. Now, you know, don't get me wrong, he's had other females in his life that I felt didn't like my, my kids. It was all about her, 
and him. <clears throat> I still never came crazy at the girl, but he had to see the fact that she ain't it. Excuse me. Respect my kids. Um, if you want to be there and you want to help my children, um, help our children, I'm fine with that. I'm never going to call somebody else to help because um, as long as somebody's there that's with their father and they're willing to, um, to step up and possibly do the things that I couldn't do, you know what I mean? But Liv isn't like that. She rather goes in um, and call her to help, um, says that I'm always and forever will be their mother, and, and she, she doesn't get the fact that she's the girl is not trying to change that. Um, they know who their mama is. They call their mama. Kids ain't stupid. And I'm sure uh, um, she's not trying to get them to call her mother. Uh, Liv just bitter. She's angry that he's happy. He's with, after he left her, he went right to her. And he hasn't changed course. Liv, on the other hand, has left him, went to the next guy, went to the next guy, went to the next guy. And she's bitter and she's upset about that. I don't know what it's going to take for Liv to get it. You know what I mean? I don't know what it's going to take for Liv to get it. Um, for her to, to stop being so bitter. And she's angry and bitter. Um, because somebody's there to help you know, to help with her children. She's not the help. She loves those She loves those kids, and you can clearly see that. You know, if she didn't, I don't think, or I could be mistaken, because it's happened before, you know, in my case, like, you're blinded by the fact that this woman really don't care too much for my kids. But I would only think, because the, the girl seemed like she has a, a good head on her shoulders. Um, she doesn't, uh, she's not trying to step on anybody's toes. She's just being the woman who she is, you know? And Liv need to understand the fact that she's not going anywhere. You know, Gerard, um, she, she got Gerard um, balanced. He's finally happy. You know, I've never seen him so happy before. Even in the you know past videos, he was in with Liv. He's happy, and you know when you're when somebody is happy, the next person tries to sabotage that. You know, the next person always feels like, oh no, I'm going to go ahead and um, create some chaos. And that's exactly what Liv is trying to do, create chaos. Instead of her being the woman, the mother that she is, she'd rather be upset and hurt. You know, she'd rather go ahead and say, don't post my children. What do you mean, don't post your children? I'm sure she got the permission and the okay from their father. She just didn't post him just because. I, I'm sure of that. You know, and I don't know. When you're bitter like that, nothing will make you happy. You know, they're gonna come, come, come back home with lots and lots of clothes and, um, Lots of stories to tell, and you know, Liv is still gonna be bitter. She and then she wants them back on the dot um, at this specific time, or else, girl, bad, bad. How can you sit there and want to dictate the fact that if they're not there at the time that they're supposed to be there, it's over? You, you, you've ruined the court order. No, because if you go back to court. 
and you try to say he didn't have him here at this time. He got him here at 601. <clears throat> Yeah, y'all, the, the the judge will probably throw that out with the quickness. Like, what? <sighs> she ain't the help live. She's somebody that cares about your children, and you should be grateful for that. Because there's some women out here that don't like the man's kids. Y'all go ahead and let me know what y'all think in the comments down below. If you got anything to say, let me know what you're feeling, how you're thinking. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't already subscribed, go ahead and subscribe. And until next time, y'all, bye.